Women will give you the Bayami just because they can control you. Women will give you the Bayami because they can, you know, they can get their way or they think you're broken or your self-esteem low. I know a lot of times you hear, I know a lot of times you hear that. I know a lot of times you hear that, uh, you know, that women like confident guys. I know a lot of times you hear that, but uh, nowadays they don't really, they're not into confident guys. That's considered toxic. A man feeling good about himself is considered toxic unless he's dealing with a lot of beautiful women that they see that he's dealing with beautiful women. They have to see you are dealing with beautiful women and know that you're dealing with beautiful women. And that's when, that's when they'll, um, they'll like you when they know but if they don't know you, you can look handsome, you can look good and all that. But if they don't know, if they don't see women around you that look better than them, look just as good or better, if they don't see women around you that look just as good or better, they're gonna um their mind is not gonna say that you're you're the type of guy that they should uh run after, even though it's for a fake reason. It's for a fake reason, it's for a temporary reason. But that's the only thing that really get the best out of women is when they know. It's when they know that uh it's when they know that you don't need them, you know what I'm saying? If they know that you um if they know that you or you know what I'm saying, if they know that you um is dealing with somebody that look better than them. It's the only time you get the best out of them um, on a regular and for free. I mean, you can get a lot out of them for free just by just by them knowing that uh, that you have options. You know what I'm saying? Beautiful women with nice shapes, laughing and smiling at you. They hugging. You know what I'm saying? They want to be around you. You know what I'm saying? You know, that alone will just put them on a, that alone will make them want to um, give you the best behavior. Even though it's fake, they'll give you the best behavior temporarily. They want to give you that, bend over and all kind of stuff for you, right? But women to deal with you because you don't need money. A lot of times women, they're more comfortable with you, especially when they get their heart broken by a rich guy or a guy with some money, with some kind of money or status or popularity. That's when they usually deal with guys that they can control. That's when they usually deal with Pookie and Ray Ray after they get, after they get extremely disappointed and dogged. After they get extremely disappointed and dogged by um, by a man that's got status, popularity, money, resources, fame, and that's when they get Pookie and Ray Ray, because Pookie and Ray Ray is non-judgmental. A, a woman can be with five hundred guys. A woman can be with five hundred guys and tell Pookie and Ray Ray, he'd be like, he won't even say nothing. He won't even have a. He won't even have an opinion on the situation. That's because Pookie and Ray Ray don't care about none of that stuff. Pookie and Ray Ray don't care about none of that stuff. The only thing Pookie and Ray Ray care about is weed and smoke. I mean, weed and drink. You know what I'm saying? That's all Pookie and Ray Ray care about, you know? So... In case you didn't know, that's all Pookie and Ray Ray care about. <laughs> Weed and smoke. And, oh, and these women, I had women crying at me, telling me, 
I got my heart broken by a bum. A girl last month, was it last month? It had to be like last month. Girl told me, walking to me, I just looked at her and turned my head. She spoke. She spoke at me. Then after she spoke, then after she spoke, she said, uh, she said, can I have a hug? I'm like, I gave her a hug. She wasn't ugly. She was a pretty attractive. Um, so, uh, what she was from? Looked like she was from Rwanda or something. But she was born in America, but she said, I just got my heart broken by a bum. I said, why you deal with a bum? She said, uh, she said she deal with a bum because she deal with a bum because she, um, She said she deal with a bum because she deal with a bum because he was broken and she felt broken. So they deal with guys based on how they feel about themselves inside. Not how good they look. Cause me and you, we might look at her and say, wow, she look good. But she might feel like she's, she, she might feel like she ugly. And that's why a lot of them switch their hairstyles and stuff like that. Not because they switching it because a lot of times they switch their hairstyles like that because they um they insecure about how they look. They ain't trying to be creative or trying to get a new style and all this. They just they switching it because they are um insecure. You know what I'm saying? They switching it because they're insecure and they feel they don't really like the way they look. They don't like themselves, you know what I'm saying? That's why they switching it up like that, you know? So that's how they do it a lot of times, you know what I'm saying? And um, so that's how, um, well, a lot of times they just, uh, they deal with guys like that. All because they feel like you're not going nowhere. A lot of times they feel like you're not going nowhere. Think he'll always be around and they always feel their confidence get up real high when they feel like somebody need them. And Pookie and Ray Ray don't have much most of the time, right? So of course a woman, even when she got a little bit, she got more than Pookie in, right? You know what I'm saying? He don't want much but some a roof to stay over. All he really wants is a roof. A roof to sleep in. You know what I'm saying? Pookie don't want much but a roof to sleep in. And uh some weed and some smoke. I mean some alcohol. So they always feel good about they always feel good about uh and they and they're not really aggressive. They ain't really they don't get their dopamine from smashing. So they're not really aggressive. They're not gonna be all touching a woman like that. They can have a conversation with a woman while she laying down butterball naked. Pookie Ray Ray ain't gonna bother. He's saying, look, can you give me $20 so I can get some of this, some of this smoke, some of this alcohol? That's what Pookie and Ray Ray trying to do. He ain't tripping off no cheeks. He trying to get buzzed. You know what I'm saying? So, it's just something to think about, right? It's just something to think about. When we see, when we see beautiful women with high class jobs, with dealing with Pookie and Ray Ray, or they look like they're dealing with some kind of handicapped guys, all because of power. It's not because they love them. They love is based on control and the fact that they feel like he belongs to them because they feel like he belongs. They, they're comfortable with him. They're comfortable with him because they can feel like they control him. They feel like he own, they own him and he, he, he becomes more like a pet than a man. You know, their respect for him is based on ownership. It's not based on his mind, heart, and personality.
you know? So they don't want that. We live in a wild world, bro. Anyway, I'm Alan Rillionaire, man. Uh, follow me on the Instagram link in the description box. My, my Instagram is Alan Rillionaire Show. Message me on there if you want to talk to me, consultation or whatever. And message me uh, if you want some of my relationship and health techniques and products. Press like, subscribe, hit the notification bell. Stay prayed up in Jesus' name. All my songs and albums, all my songs and albums and all that stuff is in the description box also. Uh, rap songs and all that good stuff. Songs, Afrobeat, all that stuff, right? So I'll holler at y'all in a little bit. Stay prayed up in Jesus' name. I'm out.